Hey everyone, Ken here with Ken's Creations and welcome to Ken's Creations Roadmap to Cricut Design Space. In this series of videos, we're gonna take a personal look at Cricut Design Space and all the different pieces that go into it that you can use to make the perfect project. So let's take a look at what today's installment is all about. One of the great features in the Cricut Design Space is the ability to have it linked to your Cricut.com account. From here, it will bring up all your images, your link cartridges, and when you're shopping, it will use your preferred payment to shop. Now, if you want to change any of these settings or take a look at them, under the menu option, there is, under account settings, account details. This is going to bring up your account info, which includes your name, address, email address, and password, your billing info, which is your current credit card on file. Now, if you need to make any changes to this, all you need to do is hit the edit account button right there, and this will bring up Cricut.com. Here's where it's going to give you the ability to change anything or update it. You have your general information. You have your shipping information, and this is where all of your product would be shipped to from Cricut.com. The payment profiles would list any payment profiles you currently have linked to credit cards. This is also where you can add certain credit cards, and this is what will be used when you're shopping in Design Space. You also have your registered products and link cartridges that are linked currently to your Cricut.com account, and these are what would show up in Design Space. There is the gift card store credit option, and this would be any kind of store credit Cricut has given you or gift cards you've received. And you can take a look at your current subscription plan, find out which one you're in, how many days you have left, and of course, what type you're in, whether it be the yearly or the monthly. This is where you can make all changes, and as soon as you're done saving them, it will automatically upload to Cricut Design Space. Well, I hope you learned something new in that installment of Ken's Creations Roadmap to Cricut Design Space. If you haven't seen all the videos in this series, make sure to click the playlist on your screen now. You'll be taken to the playlist with the collection of the entire Roadmap to Cricut Design Space videos. Also, if you haven't checked out my print to cut videos, make sure to click this playlist now. This will give you an inside look of how to calibrate your machine, update your firmware, and get your machine ready for print to cut. All right, thanks for watching today's video. Hope you guys have an amazing day. Thanks.